I'm so afraid. I'm so afraid. Hold me. Please hold me. If they do have a counter spell here, I will be so sad. So freaking sad. Come on. They, they don't. They don't. They don't. Oh my lord. They don't. What up, brothers and sisters, and welcome to MTG Malone with me, Matches Malone. Thank you also very freaking much for tuning in. I really appreciate it. I hope you're having a wonderful Friday because TGIF. Thank God it is Friday. So I'm very happy because the weekend is right here. I mean, for me, it doesn't mean anything because I'm recording a video every single day. So is there even something like weekend? I don't know. But uh, yeah, the giveaway is still going on. You still have until the 8th. The eighth at midnight. So from the seventh to the eighth, the mid, uh, then on midnight, the giveaway will close. Until then, you can check out the link over my head right now. And there is a giveaway for all of you. And there is one of my for my patrons and members who even make these giveaways so freaking possible. So yeah, thank you, patrons and members, from the bottom of my heart, from all of us. Thanks for these awesome freaking giveaways. But enough with the yammering. Let's get into the infinite combo hammering. This deck is called Convoluted, yes, but it works, trust me, it works. So, we uh, we have a lot of removal, with the Doomscar and the Meatook Massacre, we have to divide by zero, and we do have our Eitwit Shambling Guest combo to draw us cards with the Village Rites and the Deadly Dispute. If you have a Shambling Guest in hand, always sack it to the Village Rites, and then use the Deadly Dispute to sacrifice the treasure and draw yourself even more cards and make yourself a new treasure. But how do we win? With the craziest combo since a long time on this channel. So, we need four pieces. Only four, you say? Yes. Yes, only four. So, we do have the Mask with Nexus. All of our creatures now are all creature types. You know this from yesterday's video, but I thought, how can I make this even crazier? Well, like this. We have the Mask with Nexus that can also make us changelings that we can sacrifice with the Deadly Dispute and this, uh, the Village Rites to draw ourselves some cards in the worst case. Then we have the Aura, that says, whenever the Aura or another Cleric you control dies, you return a target Cleric with less mana value from the graveyard to the battlefield. And then BAM! We play the Glass Pool freaking Mimic, <laughs> yes! This creature sadly has not Shapeshifter, uh, not Changeling, written on it. That is why we need the Mask with Nexus. If this was a Changeling, oh gee, it would be so easy to pull off. But we need one more card. And that is why we have all this freaking card draw in here. Like seven cards that draw us cards. The Divide by Zero that gives us access to even more card draw with the teachings of the Kikes and the introduction to prophecy. And some stuff to, you know, survive. Because if they have their own freaking Medoc Massacre, well, we got to get rid of that. Because that is how we win. So, the Aura... Will's on the field, we play the glass pool mimic, now one of them dies. You always choose the aura to survive, not the glass pool mimic. But the glass pool mimic now also costs, is a 4 mana value creature, because it turns into the aura. It dies, it gets into your graveyard, the trigger is on the stack, you can now return the glass pool mimic, because it is a 3 cost. Changeling to the freaking battlefield, attach it to the aura, and do it all over again, and over and over and over again, and bam, you amass a million Meatook Massacre triggers, and then bam, you just kill him in one single attack. Not even attack, just kill him, you know? Just get him freaking out of here. Is this convoluted? Yes, but trust me, it works, and it feels so good. And you can beat every kind of deck as long as you make one single mistake of tapping out if they're a control deck. You win one bajillion percent. I also had some other cards in here, but I cut it down to the most essential. Uh, I also thought about getting in the one card that makes you look for legendary creatures or stuff like that. But you know, it only makes you search for the Aura or the Meatook Massacre. If you then don't have a Mask with Nexus or the Glass Pool Mimic, it doesn't really help you. It does not. Maybe we can make this work even better, but we need a lot of removal. That is why we have the three Doomscars and the four Meatook Massacres. So, yeah, you should have a good time against Aggro as well. So the Meatook Massacre 
is just very good against aggro anyways. And the Doomscar, because we're playing white thanks to the aura, we can use it. That is why it's in here. Also for the Manlands, we have 3 Field of Ruin, then we have 7 Swamps, 2 Islands and 3 Plains, 3 Shipwreck Marsh, 2 Grime Climb, Bright Climb Pathways and a Deserted Beach. But trust me, oh, this combo of these 4 cards, I want to put them each next to each other. Where's my Meatook Massacre? It's just so good. So the first thing you should have out is the Meatook Massacre, then a Mask with Nexus, and then, with all of your uh, making yourself treasures and everything, you should be able to play these two in one single turn. So all you need is kind of 4 mana and 3 treasures, or 5 mana and 2 treasures. It is absolutely freaking lootly doable. Infinite loop into infinite freaking life drain. Mmm, so good! And the aura can also be used as a blocker in the worst case, but you don't want to do that. Also, divide by zero helps you to return their Meatok Massacre to their hand. And if they do have a Meatok Massacre and you have no more divide by zeros but an eye twitch out, you can always get yourself to reduce to memory. Because the Meatok Massacre on their end is the only thing that can destroy our freaking game plan. So, yeah, our game plan is freaking crazy. We want to get in there, want the infinite loop. And that is so freaking good. In the worst case, you can also play this as a land, but you should. Keep the glass pool mimic. You always freaking need it. So, this is one of the craziest combos that I've built in the longest time. But I was thinking about ways to break the mask with Nexus even more. And I thought maybe with the aura somehow, but I didn't find a creature. And then bam, I realized the glass pool mimic still exists. <laughs> I it's it's just awesome. Also, I thought about going blue, white, and green, but uh, and black for the uh, for the other dude. I forgot the name. The Moride of the Frost. But this is not a frost creature or a snow permanent or whatever. So uh, yeah, and also it it just wouldn't work. The Moride would die. It would be a four four, and you couldn't return anything. So yeah, we have to do it like this with the glass pool mimic. I thought about it long and hard, but it just doesn't work. Also, we would have to throw even one more color in here, and that is just crazy. With these removals being double colored, no way, Jose. So, the card that searches, the snow card, the white one, not, flex uh, not flexible enough, and the Moride of the Frost, also not feasible in this deck, because it costs five, so we couldn't return it. Alrighty, so, this is convoluted, yes, it is, but it works. Trust me, if you want to play something super fun, super janky, well, here is the deck for you. I'm Matches Malone, and I will see you in those hardcore jank games. So people might ask you, isn't this overly complicated? It is. <laughs> it absolutely is. But if you're going up against a white wolf, yes, I know Spanish, then uh, you have a good time. A good freaking time. We're going first. I love it. We've Three of our combo pieces already. Three of them. What else do you want? Nothing I tell you. So, we're bringing down the eye twitch, we're getting ourselves more cards and treasure and all the good stuff. So if we're up against Mono White, we have a good time already. And if we aren't, well, well, we will see. We will have to see. But right now we're a-okay. Unless, our, of course, our opponent doesn't show up, which they should. Also, why is every time that they do an update, they uh, destroy all of the emotes? I don't get it. I don't get it. So, okay, we're one minute in, nothing happened. Oh, there it is. There is something happening. Sorry, folks. I know, you have been just listening, talking to me for one minute here without anything happening. Let's give him a friendly hello. And we're up against Mono White. I like that. I like that a lot. Yes, I do. So, with Deadly Dispute, now we even have all the colors we need. That is so good. That is so good. So, all we need to do is to find our Maskwood Nexus now, and we're super set. Oh, what is this? What if freaking heck is this? All right, are you attacking in? You're not? Okay, well then I'm not doing anything as well. Because if this goes to two, that is still alright. We will find a land here. Somehow. We can also get rid of this with our Field of Ruin, so that is also very nice. And I even might. The Blizzard Brawl. Oh, uh -huh, what? You're a Magecraft deck? 
Okay. Well, so be it. Be a Magecraft deck. Oh, there it is. All the pieces of our freaking combo. All of them. We have them all. All of them. Oh, my lord. All we need now is one black source. Good. So we cannot throw down anything here. No, and there's no need to. We we have all the combo pieces now. All we need to do is to Meetog Massacre whatever they do next turn. We will use our Deadly Dispute here. It will be free, kind of, you know? I mean, we're using mana, yes. But it's still kind of free. I was so afraid that I'm not recording here right now. Okay, they're getting in. Whatever. Whatever. Do it. Do whatever you want to do. My turn? Yes! Okay. Freaking perfection. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Okay, well, this is not as good as I hoped it would be. I really hope we would find some land, you know? Let's still do this for a three. Totally worth it. Totally freaking worth it. I mean, we now just play one thing every single turn, and we're good. So what you gonna do here? They might have the take flight card, you know, the one with the wolf on it. Would be cool, but they don't. Okay. So, we are getting rid of... Uh, what are we getting rid of? The Eye Twitch. Not needed. So we're 16 cards in and we have drawn one land. That is painful. Opponent, 12 cards in, no lands. The Clever Luminancer. Are you kidding me, game? Are you freaking kidding me? Okay. Well, I cannot draw lands. That is a little bit annoying. But only a little bit. Let's give it minus one. So that we survive. You know, surviving is of utmost importance here right now. Alright, there you go. There you freaking go. Nothing we can do for three here. Okay. Oh, only two or three more turns and we got him. <laughs> only two or three more turns. And we freaking got him. So I want to be able to do the aura in one single scoop. I, uh, yeah, and it will be possible. It will be. Oh, yes. Yes. Okay. So we're bringing you down as a blocker. Nothing more. Good. We got it. We freaking got it. Lobo Blanco, please. Please. Don't scoop. Please don't scoop. So one, two, three, four. And then we do... Okay. Please don't have a Skycliff Apparition here. The Dragon Scar Delete. Oh, yes. Yes. We did it. We did it, my friends. We freaking did it. Okay. So blue mana is open. We got a treasure. All right. Glass Pool Mimic. Get in here. Get freaking in here. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Mmm. Oh, yes. Oh, freaking yes. Oh, perfection. Oh, this is just freaking perfection. Oh, I love it so much. I love it so much. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I want to keep this one. Oh, this will take forever, but it is totally freaking worth it. Totally freaking worth it. Oh, yes. 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 Oh, yes. Oh, yes. So, we will do this for a lot now. And then as soon as we have amassed 19 triggers on the stack, we will uh, get the Meatog Massacre up and running. Okay. Well, maybe we should bring this in first this time so that they know what's going on. Okay. So, slowly but surely, just so they know, I, I cannot wait this long. I cannot wait this... Oh my lord, this is so good. This is so good. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, sweet. Baby Jesus. This is so amazing. Yes. Oh, yes. And they're looking at it. They're looking at all the combo. Oh, genius. Just freaking genius. I love it so much right now. I really do. I really freaking do. Oh, yes. Yes. So how many meat hook triggers do we have here? How many? How many? I don't know. I really don't know. But it will be enough very soon. So. 
Oh, jeez. Thank you, Lobo Blanco. Thank you so much. Also, this is the first game I'm recording and it already works. I'm so freaking happy. I'm so freaking happy right now. I mean, we had the removal. No matter what would have happened, the Medoc Massacre would have done its job. So it's all good. It's all freaking good. So, do we have enough now? I really don't know. I really don't. But we should. We should have enough now. Holy smokes. Yeah, I think we do. I think we do. Because this is always one. Yes. Okay. So I think this should be enough. Is there any way for me to check here? There is. There is. Okay, let's check. So, how many do we have here? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And six. Okay. It is enough. It is enough. Good. So we can bring it in as a creature, uh, as a copy of something else now. Whoo! We did it! We freaking did it! I can't believe it! <laughs> Thank you, Lobo Blanco! Oh my lord! Oh my lord! It totally takes four cards, this simple little combo. Mmm! Mmm! Insane! I cannot believe we did it! Did it deep! Oh, we're going first and we have three of our combo pieces already. I would be s crazy not to keep this. Crazy, I tell you. All we need is one more black source to have the Meatog Massacre. Or one of our creatures that we can sacrifice to the village rights. But we're looking super good right now. It's Mono White even. Okay, we do have a chance against Mono White. It's not like we don't. So, as I said, all we need... One freaking black source. All I care about. Intrepid adversary. Come on, give me a black source here. That is no black source. That is actually no black source. One more glass pool mimic. If they do have the uh, flyer here now, we're s pretty sad. Not gonna lie. Not gonna freaking lie. The Redane. Doesn't make it. Oh, come on. Are you serious here, game? Are you freaking serious? This is bad. But we can bring down the aura at least to gain ourselves some life back, you know? That is very good already. The Mall of the Sky Clip. This guy. This guy. Okay, well, we're up against Mono White, as per usual. One of the best decks there is. And we're just dead, you know? If they now attack in with everything, we're just dead. Nothing we can do about it. Just nothing. We didn't find another black source. The shambling gas was three turns too late, dude. Three turns too late. Where have you been? I missed you so bad. They just have good game. Well, that was a quickie. That was a quick one. There was nothing we could have done. We needed a black source. We didn't find it. But we found three glass pool mimics. Hey, not bad. Excellent. Freaking excellent. You know, losing against one of the top decks in the meta. It's always okay. But losing because you couldn't find one single black source? Oh, that was painful. Alright, we do have two of our combo pieces here. And we do have the Shambling Guest. The Mask Wood Nexus is just so good if you have to stall the game a little bit. And in the worst case, we just make ourselves a million little uh, shapeshifters. And uh, kill them all with the Meadow Massacre. Might be good. Schnaggles. What you doing, Nicholas? So... It sounds like Nicholas, but with Schnaggles, you know, that is, that, that was, that, I'm sorry. I, I, I will see myself out. What? You, I can't? I have to pull this? Okay. It's extra turns. It's freaking extra turns. I mean, yeah, we're still getting in there for some tasty damage every single turn, but we're up against extra turns. Oh, Schnaggles. First Mono White, now this. So even after Mono White, I thought, you know... Yeah, I have a nice hand against aggressive decks. Well, there you go. Lucky as a champ. Lucky as a champ. Oh. Oh. They're just extra turns with extra steps, aren't they? Yeah, they are. They are. They are. They one bajillion percent are. Nothing else. Just nothing freaking else. Therefore, telling something. That is all right. We found our deadly dispute. That is super good. And I will use one here right now to find myself some stuff. Yes, yes. 
Create a treasure. Please, no lands. Oh, it's an aura. That is awesome. So we're only one land away. Uh, one card away from our combo. One single freaking card away. Oh, I love it a lot. So much. I love it so much. The Strix... Ah, ah, you really are just extra turns with extra steps. Oh, I should have seen it coming. Should have seen it freaking coming. Yeah. Sad. But totally understandable. Why shouldn't people be playing extra turns if there's just what's in the meta, you know? But all we need is our freaking uh, shapeshifter and we're super good. Super good. They're still a little bit far away from using it. So hey. Sure hey. And only one extra turn won't help them at all. So they need a lot of extra turns. Yes, do it. Get yourself the point counter. So, but we do have the aura, we do have the mask with nexuses, so we can get in there for some damage every single turn. And this mask with nexus makes us a creature every single turn, so that is alright. The sunset revelry. Okay, buying himself some time, absolutely understandable. But they didn't draw a card for it, so that is good already. Very good already. We got it. Freaking got it. We freaking got it. Is this enough? It is not. It is not enough. But we are very freaking close. Very close. Oh my lord. We got it. We got it in our hands. Okay, passing the turn. Just hope that they don't have a freaking counter spell here. Or whatever. I think they will be cheeky. I feel like they might be cheeky here. Maybe playing a Teferi or something like that, you know? I will make myself a Maskwood Nexus, though. During their end step, so that maybe... They think, what did they do? And if they have a removal for it, they might be using it here. Are they, though? I mean, they might. They might do something. And we have two aura, so yeah, we can try to bring one down. Another sunset revelry. Okay. Do you have what it takes, though? Do you have it? Do you have the counter spell? I'm so afraid. They might freaking have it, you know? They might freaking have it. We're getting in there. With our shapeshifter. Do they have counter spells? I mean, they should, right? They freaking should. Blocking one, okay. I'm so afraid. I'm so afraid. Hold me. Please hold me. If they do have a counter spell here, I will be so sad. So freaking sad. Come on. They, they don't. They don't. They don't. Oh my lord. They don't. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, oh, they don't. <coughs> they don't have it. They don't have it. The infinite loop is back. Take that extra turn stack. Oh, checking if I'm recording. Double. Oh, oh, oh. Please don't you tell me that you're uh, you're doing something annoying now, like roping me. Schnaggles. What you doing? What are you doing? That's what I thought. That is what I thought. You're not doing anything. Not doing freaking anything. Alright, Shambling Gas is activated. So this is one. I will have to count here. I want to do it all in one single scoop. Come on. Come on. 
You don't have anything to get rid of my graveyard. You do not. You do not. Schnaggalus. Come on. Don't you... Don't, don't you rope me. Don't you rope me. Let's give him a moo. <laughs> it kind of looks like me, if you think about it. Don't. Don't think about it. Oh, my lord. Come on. Don't you do this now. Don't you... Don't you do this now. Let's give him a little slappity slap on the wrist here. I know it's our hand, but still. Oh, Schnaggalus. Come on. Come on, Schnaggalus. Oh, they're back. They're back. Perfection. Freaking perfection. So this is two. A three. And a scoop. Oh, they didn't want to see it happening. Get out of here, Vespalark. Malone is here in standard. Mmm. Mm, my voice is crackling for excitement. Mmm. So good. So freaking good. Mmm. So no matter what happens from here on out, we're good. We got two wins in. The opponent's going first. Oh, we don't have any black. We cannot keep this, sadly. Now we have only black. I mean... And now we cannot keep this. And this is better. Not perfect, but better. At least we survive for a little bit, you know. Should have kept it to be... Oh, it's another Exoturn stack. Oh, it's Mill! It's freaking Mill! Are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Well, we can get rid of that Ruin Crab sooner or later. If we want to. Oh, no. Well, at least they're milling us the good stuff. At least that's what's going on. But please, don't you do this now. All we need to do is to overrun him sooner or later. Mill. Of all things unholy. I was not prepared for that. Oh, they missed a land drop, didn't they? Oh, they did not. They, did, they didn't miss a land drop. Oh, there is one aura. Very bad. Very, very bad. Do not like it at all. Oh, they're doing this immediately. Smurt. Pretty smurt. Okay, let's get ourselves a uh, blue source so that we have it. Because we have a lot of black sources in the deck, so we might draw them. Oh, another or Oh, no. Oh, no. This is going to be very, very bad, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. We're foretelling you now. And we will see what they're doing, but if they have an answer for my... Oh, my lord, please don't. It's another Meat Hook Massacre. Oh, that is so bad. That is just so bad. Oh, they're foretelling a counter spell here now. Oh, my lord. Please don't you tell me. Don't you tell me that we're screwed here. Don't you. Freaking don't you. Please don't be a counter spell. Please don't be a Javari disruption or something like that. The test of all, of all things unholy. Oh, Rudbeckia. Beating our jank with jank. Not cool. So this is a double up your spell. And then they will, uh, you know. At least we draw a card here. Maybe it's something good. It is something good, actually. Okay. We're bringing down a Maskwood Nexus next turn. I think this is a double up spell so that they can do the Tasha's Hideous Laughter. Which is so annoying. I hope they miss land drops. I mean, they sacrifice the land. That is usually what happens. Oh, they did not miss a land drop. Okay, those were okay. Didn't care about those draws. Crush the weak. Okay. And there it is. Oh, no. Oh, no. We have no more auras left, do we? No, we don't. Oh my lord, I don't know how we want to win this now. I think we're getting milled here, my friends. I think we do. I think we're just getting super hardcore milled here. Yeah, all of our combo pieces are gonzo. Oh no! Oh, why? Ruin crab! Why? No, not you! I thought we were friends. I thought you and I, we had a thing going, you know? Of being friends. Mill and Mono White. These two. Get out of here. 
Get out of here. Ruining my good old fun. Hmm. Oh, ruin crab. How could you do me this dirty? I really don't like it. I don't even know what accent that was. It was Maloney. Just a Maloney accent. We're up against Halcyon. Halcyon. We are going first. I love it. We have two of our combo pieces in hand already. Delicious. Freaking delicious. So let's pretend like we're an Orzhov deck for the longest time. And then bam. Shipwreck Marsh. Oh, it's mono white. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Really? Really? Well, okay. Well, I, I will not complain anymore. But that also means that we can bring down the Shipwreck Marsh. Do you have another one? Do you now? The Luminarch Aspirant. Alrighty. Annoying. Freaking annoying. But it also means that we can just block here. And, uh, you know, block. Maybe we even find something to work here with, with the Deadly Dispute. Would be amazing. Don't you get me wrong, I would love it. Another Mono White deck. Oh no. Mono White is really bad. If you don't have the answers in your hand immediately. It is just very, very bad. So they're afraid of retaliation. And maybe we even find something here. I would be so happy. Create a treasure. Oh, we did find something. Not bad, not bad. The Sun Gold Sentinel. Yeah, I don't really care about that. Do I now? No, I don't. I will later, though. I will later. So. I will bring down the Field of Ruin just in case they bring out something that I don't like. And do we bring down an Aura as a blocker? Yeah. Or do we? Or do we? I mean, we would lose our treasures. And what is the worst that could happen here? Not much, you know? They bring down a Faceless Haven, we still have an answer. There it is, the Faceless Haven. I was waiting for you, my friend. I really was. Yeah, we're getting rid of that immediately. And getting ourselves another uh, Black Source. So that we have the blue if we need it. And we do have the white here, so it's all good. All good in the neighborhood. Holding my beard. Out of approval. We're getting the Black Source. Also thinning our deck for lands. Always appreciated. Right now we're still looking for some card draw. We are looking for card draw. The Eye Twitch. Very good. That will help us draw cards. So we're getting rid of your board. We break down the Eye Twitch. And then maybe we're even bringing down an aura just to survive for a little bit, you know? The Stoma, ah, oh, they have an answer here. Yeah. Not bad, my friend. Not bad at all. Okay. Well, kind of to be expected, to be honest. Kinda. Come on, give me... Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay. We're only one combo piece away. Only one. And we're still alive. We are still freaking alive. That is all that matters right now. And with the aura, we will also be happy. The Brutal Cathar. Not good. Not freaking good. Okay. So we're running out of removal, you know? Oh my lord. Oh. My. Lord. Bringing down the aura. So that we have a blocker. If we need it. One, two, three, four. If we draw a land here, we win. If we draw a freaking land here, we win. Are they attacking in? They're not. They're not attacking in. That is so good. I don't want it to turn day here. Absolutely not. I hope they don't have two cards. Of course they do! Of course- what? No! Oh my lord! How unlucky was that? Oh, how unlucky was that? Of all the things they could have gotten here. Why was that the thing? Why? Why though? Freaking why? Oh my lord, yeah, get screwed. Get freaking screwed. There you go. Just take this, my friend. Take this and bite on it! Chew on it! Chew on it! Holy smokes! That is what you get, man! 
That is what you get. Oh, get in there. So now we even have a blocker. So now they really need to remove our aura or our Maskwood Nexus or Metok Massacre once more. We did it. We got Mono freaking White. Mm, get out of here. Get freaking out of here. Okay, that is one. Oh, yes, yes. And we only have one creature in here, so it does it automatically. Oh, do you see what I'm doing here? Do you see what I'm doing here now? Nice. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Oh, get out of here, Mono White. Mm, get out of here. Oh, so sweet. Can't believe that we won three games already. Can't freaking believe it. Mmm. Oh, my. Beating Mono White always feels so freaking good. I feel amazing right now. All right, opponent's going first. If you see this, you always know your opponent's going first. Okay, we have two of our combo pieces, which I like a lot. We're missing one might white mana for the Doom Scar, but you know, in the worst case, there will be some way to find it. Sooner or later. I hope this won't be the revenge of Mono White. Oh, the mulligan. It's a bad sign. Oh, it is Mono White. Oh. Oh. And that is not even that bad for us. I hope they don't play black. If they do play black, well, that could be bad. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> I will say that one more time here. Oh, man. I really hope that we would find a freaking white source. We couldn't yet, but we might be able to sooner or later. We will see. We will freaking see. One white source is all we need. Oh, wow. How many more of those do you have? Well, in the face of our infinite combo, it doesn't really matter, does it? No, it does not. Oh my lord. We really cannot find a white source here, can we? That would be amazing to have one. Just one single white source. But all they have are these Lunark veterans, so yeah. What even gives? Okay, we do have the Eye Twitch. That will buy us some time and help us find a freaking white source. So that we can finally wipe this freaking board here. Do we even? I don't know yet. We will see. We will see. Oh, Yukel. All right, we will. We absolutely will. I mean, they can bring back one creature each turn, which is absolutely A-OK. -okay. In the eyes of our infinite combo, nothing really matters. And anyone can see that nothing really matters to me. Oh, I twitch your perfect little blocker here. And maybe you even find us a white source. Who knows? Who freaking knows? But just in case, I will still get myself the good old thing here. The environmental science. I mean, it also buys us some time. We do have the Shamley boy here now as well, which is good. Don't you do it like this game. Don't you. Just don't. Just don't. And we still couldn't find a white source. Or one of our other combo pieces, so that is a little bit annoying. Just a little bit. I mean, once more, we have all the lands in the world. Like, we're 15 cards in and have 8 lands. That is just a little too much, you know? Just a little bit too much. The Intrepid Adversary. Good. That is a nice little target. Oh my lord. Even more land? Even more land? Are you kidding me, game? Well, we can still block the Intrepid Adversary here if we want to. This costs three. The Luminous Phantom. Good. Are you attacking in, though? You're not. Oh my gosh! This is a little much, you know? Just a little bit too much. Holy smokes! Like, what is this? 17 cards and 11 lands? Get up. Yeah, all right. Come on, game. Seriously, come on. This is no way to treat me. This is just no way to freaking treat me. Holy smokes. What the heck, man? What the freaking heck? Now we found another aura. That is so useless right now. I need something. Come on. This is how we lose the game now? This is how we lose now? Like this? Oh, no, 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 no. That is brutal. Like, our opponent was on 
two lands. While we amassed a total of freaking 11 lands in the first 18 cards, that is so many lands. So many. Please give me something here. Please, game. Please, I beg of you. I freaking beg you. I beg you so hard. Like I've never begged anything before. Come on. Come on. It's a shambling guest. It's a freaking shambling guest. That is so useless right now. Game. Man. Good game. You know, this is just so unfair. This is no way to lose in the end. 19 cards, 11 lands, that is just too much. We have so much removal in here. And we couldn't find it. And they had the perfect... This is so uncool, game. Seriously? Boo on you. Boo on you. Totally uncalled for. Totally freaking uncalled for. Get out of here. Holy smokes, that last game, wow. Like, talk about a land flood. If you ever seen a land flood, there it was. There it freaking was. I'm not even counting glass pool mimics as lands. Not at all. But holy smokes, drawing 11 lands, that is almost half of our lands in the first 18 cards. Come on, game. And our opponent just drew perfectly with two lands. With two freaking Lance, maybe I should have waited a little longer with the Doom Scar, but to be honest, I thought it was a good time. I could have taken one more hit maybe, but hey, who would have known that they just pop off like this? It was very, very, very bad. I was very sad. But before we get into the wrap up like a chewing gum, I want to thank all of my patrons and members because thanks to you, I can give back to this awesome community that we build around us and that means the world to me. So from the bottom of my heart, I want to say thanks to all of our patrons and members, starting with our Zed with great hardest, Randy Campbell, John, Chris Stevens, Atomatom, Vince MH, Vicky White, John Val, Felipe Rodriguez Diaz, Jeremiah Francois, Mike, Grey Wolf, Unmercy88, Steve-O, Jonathan Norton, Empty Bag, Morphe, Luis Felipe Sanchez Perez, Jared Teleskiewicz, Albert Tuki, Nililand Juan, Jose Seron, Marcario Frescas, Caleb Horst, Troy Graham, Court Du, Bandai, Just the Manor, and Oran. A special thanks, of course, to our Gold Span Dragons, mm, Waffles, Randy A.K. Donald T., Jan Newman, Simster65, William White, Rico Colombaroli, Marco Marino, your boy Big Bizzle, Mr. Mild, Damien Tay, James Wade, Monkey Rage, Jack Top, Jefferson Meyer, Phil, Double OG, Raven, Chipster, Nerd, Paul English, Wolf, and Anima. And a special thanks, of course, to our Nico Bolas, God Pharaohs, Earl, Chris Katowski, Grandoff, Danny Montgomery, William Smith, Aria Wolf, The Lacrime, Brian O'Reilly, Malchija, and Quixen Deal. You people are amazing. I really freaking appreciate it, CEO, so much. I, I couldn't do anything without you. Not buying new packs, not doing these giveaways, nothing I tell you. So really from the bottom of my heart, thank you so freaking much. I really, really appreciate it. You guys are amazing. And uh, yeah, if you want to become part of this awesome list, you can check out the Patreon and the membership below every single video. They're both the same. One is Patreon, one is YouTube. Choose a poison. In the end, it all comes together. So yeah, but think of yourself first. If you don't have any hard-earned cash to share, don't you worry about it. Sweet summer chat is always, always, other ways to support the channel, like subscribing. It is free. I started the giveaway not even a week ago, like five days ago. In five days we amassed another 200 people on this channel. I'm... I'm shocked. That is so cool. I love doing what I do and I love to see that people are supporting me. That is amazing. And if I can ever do anything for you, let me know. Your boy Malone is here for you. So yeah, the last game was crazy, but have you seen the craziness? People scooped as soon as they realized this is just such a crazy freaking combo. Vespalark and Standard. There it is. There it freaking is. They had to ban cards. They had to change them the first time that ever happened because of the Vespalark combo. They had to change the Davriel's blah blah withering. That's the name. Thank you very much, person that doesn't exist. So, the Vesper Lark combo, here it is. It only takes four cards. So, hey, easy as freaking pie. <laughs> easy as, as freaking pie. That game against Mono White, the 
Oh my lord, that was so good. So yeah, as I promised, there will be some crazy decks for these last six days. So six more crazy decks. I will not start ramping before. Maybe I will play one evening with some uh, with some control deck. Try to get at least into diamond. That would be nice before the next set hits. But even if we don't, I, I just, you know, people will just be playing the same three decks over and over again until the end of the season. Until the new set hits, I wanted to say. And after that, it will be even more mono white. Oh, jeez, even freaking more. It's going to be crazy. These new cards are insane. I'm so looking forward to the new set. So much. So, once more, some people did it yesterday with the pickle rig. That meant a lot to me. A freaking lot. So if you uh, see this today, put in convoluted in the comments, please. Convoluted with a little heart would mean the world to me. So I know who even watches these videos until the end. And if I see you, I will give you a comment even another little heart. So there will be a lot of hearts. So yeah, thank you all so very freaking much. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, become part of the Malone family. Leave a like, share the video with one of your closest friends. I'm Matches Malone and I will see you all. Tomorrow!